Hello and welcome everyone. Uh, I have a little problem. I'm going to try to make this pretty short and simple, but I need some help from anybody that's out there about the CPUs, how to overclock a CPU. Uh, let's see. This is what I have in the computer. Uh, I'll go ahead and load it up and I'll show you. Uh, so ho hopefully somebody can kind of give me an idea here. Okay, here's the AMD Cephron 3400 socket. I'll just go ahead and let y'all whoever knows about this stuff go ahead and take a look at this and I'll click to the next one as you can see right here it shows you what it is here okay and that you can always pause the video okay here it is model here's the model right here main board and the other part I showed you is the CPU memory. You can always, like I said, pause it. Right there. And that's about this program. Okay, uh, anyway, as you can see, this is what I'm having a problem with, as I'll show you uh, right now. Okay, I'll run the, uh, let's see what you call this, the performance test. Like someone showed me on there. And what I do, I run a benchmark on the whole thing. Uh, no, I don't want to do the whole thing. I just want to test one thing. CPU, all. And what it'll do, it'll run the test. And I'll go ahead and show you what I have in here once the test is done. Just on this is for the CPU here. And then I'll open up my Rivetuner and show you the problem. That's where I'm having what I'm having is the Rivetuner. I cannot open I can't do any overclocking. Well I mean, I'll go ahead and open it. I just wanted to show you what results I have here on on that. Okay, it should be about done. There. All right, that, there's my results right there, as you can see. Okay, I'll go over here to start and open my rivet tuner up. And they say to pick every video I've been looking at. It'll say pick this here. Yeah, I guess it'd be a CPU or something, whatever. But this is all I have in there. The it's showing just the video card, and I can't even overclock the video card. Which I'm not worried about that part. It's a 512 megabyte. Uh, anyway, I go right here where it says customize, and that's what I've been doing. Everybody else does. But now I click it. As you can see, this is the only options I have. Where is that little? Should be another box right here. It says uh, looks like a little video card, you know, a little card. But it's not there. Anyway, if anybody can help me on that problem. Uh, I guess this board cannot be overclocked. I mean, I don't know if there's a program out there that doesn't cost anything. Cause I don't want to pay nothing. To, I mean, if I have to pay something, I might as well just go buy me another board. I'll just do that. But if anybody can kind of help me on this little problem, I'd really appreciate it. All right, thank you, and bye-bye. Uh,